Hi, this is Lalit from Himla Yoga Valley. Um, today we look in the posture of Purvottanasana. Um, as we practice Paschimottanasana, after we need to rely on our spine. So there's a counter posture of forward bend, Purvottanasana. Um, in this posture, before we start, so always again we have to follow simple principle: sitting straight in Dandasana, knee straight, and place the palm behind the back. As we place our palm behind the back, now toe pointing forward and inhale. Raise your hips off the floor. Try to place your toe down on the mat, opening our chest and keep the neck lined with the spine. Hold here for five breaths, elbow straight. And also when you practice, make sure we are sticking our joint. Five breath here. After five breath, exhale first, bring your hips down on the mat and back into Dandasana. So that's the Purvottanasana posture. <coughs> the other way we can practice as you're practicing Purvottanasana sometime also is a very challenge posture because this is also arm balancing and also heart opening posture, kind of sometimes is a back bend also. So the second option we can follow as we're learning this pose, we can place the forearms down on the mat, that's to measure our hand distance and then slowly up back into Dandasana. Then we bend our knees and keep our feet distant apart. We call this posture tabletop. So this is for those practitioners, those have very tight shoulder and a new beginners, those are practicing, they're finding challenge to practice Purvottanasana. Inhale, raise your hips of the floor. So we follow same principle here. So knees directly above your ankle here, staking our joints, neck line with the spine. Sometimes people always bring the head back, which is not very good because that could cause some serious injury to your neck. So I always tell people chin lock, five breath here and keeping your feet distant apart very important after five breath exhale place your hips on the mat both like stretched out back to dandasana so this was a purvottanasana the counter posture of paschimottanasana so i hope um, this tip will help you to improve your posture thank you